Tim. Sim Tim TV. With the help of friends. Mickey the mouse and Cruz the crow became great friends. One day the crow came calling on the mouse with eyes full of tears. Worried, the mouse asked, "What's the matter? Why are you so sad? I am thoroughly fed up with this country. I want to go elsewhere," replied the crow. "Hunters are busy trapping birds in the nets." I have escaped narrowly. I don't know when my turn will come. I want to leave this country before it comes," said the crow. "What are your travel plans then?" asked the mouse. "There is a big lake in the middle of a vast forest in the south. I have a friend there, a turtle whose name is Totty. He is a great host who will feed me with fish, pieces of meat." etc Mickey said If that is so I will also follow you I am also very sad On a fine day the crow with the mouse on his back flew to the great lake in the middle of the forest His friend Totty saw him with the mouse on his back The crow then left the mouse at the bottom of a tree and flying to the top of it loudly addressed the turtle Totty came out of the water and was happy to see him. The crow then came down from the tree and the two of them embraced each other. The crow, the mouse and the turtle put a break to their conversation when they saw a frightened deer darting towards the lake. The crow flew to the top of a tree. The mouse scampered into his hole and the turtle sank into the water. From the tree top the crow could see the deer now clearly and told his other friends Friends he is only a deer who is thirsty these footfalls are not those of a man the turtle replied The deer is panting it seems someone is chasing him he has not come to quench his thirst surely some hunter might be after him assured that these are friends only the deer named Bamble Now said friend you have guessed correctly i have escaped the arrow of the hunter and reached here with difficulty i am in search of a shelter the hunter cannot reach please show me a place safe from the hunter that is not necessary said cruz the crow i have seen the hunters taking a good catch of food and going the way they came oh totty You can now come out of the water. With Bamble the deer, they became now four friends, happily spending time in each other's company. One day, Bamble had not come when the other three had gathered at the lakeside for the daily discourse. They thought, "Poor Bamble has not come so far. Is it possible that a lion or a hunter has killed him? Or is it possible that he has fallen into a pit well wishers naturally suspect the worst when the near and dear ones are not seen for a while totty told the crow friend you know neither mickey nor i can move fast you alone can fly and see more things than we can please go immediately and find out what is happening to our friend The crow did not fly too long before he saw Bamble trapped in a hunter's net near a small pond. Moved by his plight, the crow said, "Friend, what happened to you?" Trying to check tears in his eyes, the deer said, "Death is chasing me. It is good that you came to see me." Cruz flew fast to where the mouse and the turtle were anxiously waiting for him to come and tell them What happened to the deer? On hearing his account, Mickey immediately decided that he should go and bite off the strings of the hunter's net. He got on to the back of the crow, and together they flew to the spot where the deer lay helplessly in the hunter's net. As they were discussing the plan to escape, Cruz and Mickey saw that the turtle also was coming. The crow said, 
Look, the slow-footed guy is coming. If the hunter comes, I can fly away and you can beat a fast retreat. But how can this turtle escape? The hunter came when they were debating this point. The mouse did a fast job of biting off the strings of the net and the deer rushed into the thick forest. The mouse too disappeared into the nearest hole. But the poor turtle was slowly plodding its way to safety. Thus, the hunter saw him and bound him to his bow and slung it across his shoulder and began going home. Mickey said, Let us first look for a way to rescue the turtle. The crow said, Listen and do as I tell you. Bamble will go to a small lake on the hunter's way, taking him home. He should pretend he is dead and I will sit on his head and pretend picking his eyes. Seeing the motionless deer, the hunter will then rest the turtle on the ground and reach for the deer. Mickey should at once reach the turtle and bite off the strings, binding him to the bow. All right, we will do as you say, said the mouse and the deer. Meanwhile, the hunter, seeing the motionless deer, thought it was dead. Leaving the turtle on the ground, he came to the deer. The deer at once ran away and the crow flew away. At the other end, the mouse bit off the strings, binding the turtle to the bow. The turtle entered into the water and the mouse ran to his hole. Moral, friend in need is a friend indeed.